Hi, I'm Lisa from Makers HQ. We're a community interest company based in Plymouth and we upskill people in the local community to work in the fashion and textiles industry. So I'm going to show you how to replace a button on a jacket and I'm going to use this beautiful men's sea salt jacket for this. So what you do, you need to do is create what we call a thread shank. And that's what I'm going to show you how to do today. And then we're going to need to find a thread that matches. You don't want to just put the, the, the whole wheel of thread on your garment. You need to actually pull the thread out and lay it on the garment to see which is the closest. So if I lay these two out, so let's get myself a length of thread. I'm going to have quite a long length because I'm going to sew this on doubled like this and there. And I'm going to create a knot with both these threads so that as I'm sewing, both threads will go through at the same time. I need to effectively raise the button off the garment slightly. The easiest way to do that is I'm just going to get some card so that the button can sit on the card when I'm sewing it on. The first thing I'm going to do is get my thread and I'm going to actually put the knot on the top here because that's going to be hidden by the button. You can't see it on the back then. So bring that thread through to the back. So I'm going to sit my cardboard down sit my button on top of the card, come up and down through the button. Carry on doing that until your thicknesses look the same as the previous buttons, the buttons that are already sewn on here. So now I just need to create the thread shank. So in order to do that, I just take my thread, which is currently at the back, and I bring it through so that the needle comes through in between the front of the garment and the back of the button. Twist this thread oh, round and round the button and it just creates a little shank there to lift the button up and support it. I'm just going to take my needle back through to the back of the garment here and just finish off the thread, three or four stitches on top of one another. That just secures it. And that's all looking great. So that sits beautifully once it's buttoned up. You're ready to go.